Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, we will use this container, some food coloring, some hot and cold water, and food dye to help us understand deep ocean currents. Currents found on the surface many times are caused by winds. However, underneath the surface, the world and its ocean has many currents that flow. In this demonstration, you will get a better understanding of how this happens. Currents beneath the surface are caused are by changes in temperature. And in this side, I have warm water. And if I put my thermometer in there and let it... Um, and if I read it, it is close to 80 degrees. And on the other side, I have placed ice in it. And if you read the thermometer, I'll let it sit here just for a second. Okay, it reads close to 35 degrees. So obviously we have cold and hot. And I'll represent the hot water with some red food dye. And the cold water, let's make it blue. Okay, and again, cold water is more dense than warm water, so it should flow underneath. And as it flows, you should be able to see how currents are created. Okay, so I will open this up and let's see if we can't get some currents going. Okay, the colder blue water is going underneath the warmer red water. And you can see how ocean currents are formed. In fact, you almost see little waves taking place. Okay. Now at the same time, the warm air on this side is flowing upward like a convection current. Okay. So now I'm going to shut this and I'm going to stir this side and its temperature and also its density should be somewhere in between these two. So I'm going to change its color and I hope this will work into a green. Okay. And so all goes well, it should flow in between because its temperature and density should be in between. And again, let's see if a convection current or some type of current is created. So there goes the green, and you can see it is flowing in between those two. So and as it's flowing, you can begin to get an idea of how currents in the ocean and throughout the world are created by first changes in salinity and second changes in temperature. Thanks for watching and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.